What's going on, fellow fish tank fanatics? So you all might have seen the video. Um, I've got a female holding down here. Man, they are just that male though is destroying my female or my my other four. The female acted like she's going up to the surface picking up food, um, but she's spitting uh, crushed pellets um, out of her gills. So I don't know if if the the eggs maybe are starting to suck up their egg sac. I, I don't know. Um, there's no information on them, so we're just stuck not knowing right now. Um, I think this time I'm going to let nature take its course, uh, let the, the female and male, and even the male keeps coming up here too. This is where she was at. I don't know if maybe they've got a nest. I, I can't find anything, so I'm just going to let them be, see what happens. Um, the other four look terrible. They are beat up. So I don't know, I'm probably will drop in a couple things of PVC and see if I can give them some some caves for now. But you can see how nasty this tank is, it's driving me crazy. But that's not what I wanted to talk about. I wanted to bring up this other fish species that I picked up recently, and this is Benito Chromis Rio Rio Munensis. Um, I'll put the spelling in the description box. These are endangered. So it's just really awesome to, to have a wild caught pair. As you can see already here, look what this male has done. Dug out a big old hole. So we can only hope that they will be breeding for me sooner than later. Uh, female's getting in her breeding dress. Um, male looks good. I've only had these guys for literally four days. So it's nice to see this. They are doing well. I have other tanks set up because um, this tank will be coming down sooner than later. But it's pretty cool to see them already digging out a hole. And I figured I'd showcase them a little bit since they are rarely seen in the hobby now too. Um, it's the same thing with most of my other fish I keep. These are West Africans. Uh, these come from Cameroon. Um, yeah, that's about all I know on them. There's not a ton of info, but they're pretty. The female's really pretty when she's in breeding dress. But I've got fish tanks shutting off all around me. I just figured I'd show you all. I mean, giant holes. So, it's fun. Um, now with my others in here, I've got a male pelvic acromus subasalatus, and I have my Congochromus Sabina in here. We've got these two, which are both females. And this one, I, I believe, is going to be a nice male. So, um, lucky for me, it looks like I do have a male Congochromus. Um, after my first male committed suicide, uh, committed suicide with his breeding tooth down, which was another bummer. But either way, Benitochromis Reomunensis, the newest editions.